My father was famous around here. I saw him fight. I saw him go down many times. But he never stayed down. I'm Daredevil. He wants to know that he's still got it. The thing is, events like this exact a toll. Repeating traumatic experiences compounds that toll, creating a pressure. Until one day I go postal? Yeah, I get it. Well, the point is, you have to process this stuff. I process it. When I finally was out in front of this bastard, and Fisky knew I thought that. He was waiting for me. Matthew. Boggy and Karen, both of them could have been killed. And there would have been nothing I could have done to stop it. <sighs> nothing. You're not strong enough to beat the man I sent for you. You're not smart enough to beat me. What were you going to do to Fisk? Kill him. This isn't their fight. Your father never knew when to lay down. Fisk is my problem. And that's what I want for you. Someone to accept you without shame. Look into your own eyes and tell me you are not heroic. But you have not endured or suffered or lost the things you care about most. I'm Daredevil. Not even God can stop that now. Rage cannot stay inside. It needs to go somewhere. Everyone you ever cared about left you. Or it becomes a poison. It will kill you from within. What is it to be a hero? Look in the mirror and you'll know. God knows you want to, but you don't get to destroy who I am. You will go back to prison and you will live the rest of your miserable life in a cage, knowing you'll never have the next that this city rejected you. It beat you. I God's plan is like a beautiful tapestry. And the tragedy of being human is that we only get to see it from the back. With all the ragged threads and the muddy colors. And we only get a hint at the true beauty that would be revealed if we could see the whole pattern on the other side. God does. <laughs> 